In this question, they want to know what is the length of side M in figure B. So here's figure B. Here is side M. Well, it's tough to tell from the diagram, and I think they should give you a little bit more uh, information. And I, I think it might have gotten cut off here, but I think they tell us that figure A right, and B are, are similar. Um, and, and, or, or congruent, they might even say, which means that they're copies of each other, but just in different spots, right? This is over here and this is over there, but they're copies of each other. If that's the case, then M definitely needs to equal 5 feet, because those are in the same spot. But also, it, even if they didn't tell us that and they forget to give us the right information, you could tell that this length is essentially the exact same as M, right? They're right across from each other there. And you shouldn't make that assumption always. That can be very misleading. But if you don't have any of the tools here, um, that's what I would do to figure it out, that these two sides are, are opposites and equal from each other. The next thing they ask us is, what is the, f the perimeter of figure B? Well, we can fill in the gaps here. right? This side and this side are corresponding. They're in the same relative spot. They're both 3 feet. This side and this side should be the same length. They're both 3 feet. So now to find perimeter, all we do is add every side of the shape. That's what perimeter really is. So we add 3 and 3, which is 6. We add 5 and 5, which is 10. And another 3 and 3, which is another 6. Add up these, and we get 22 feet. And that's our perimeter here, 22 feet. All right, hope that helped.